What do you think, Plaque? Ugh, what's the point of giving someone something that can't be eaten and doesn't have a scent? If you gave me that, I'd be seriously offended. Maybe I should get a second opinion. What is it? It's a gift I've made for Marinette. We're organizing a surprise birthday party for her. Marinette? You know, the girl who won the fashion contest? She made the hat I wore at your show. She's a really awesome girl. She loves helping others I don't and... remember giving you permission to go to your friend's birthday party. Please, Father. Marinette deserves to have all her friends there. All right, then. <sighs> Thank you, Father. I always carry the lucky charm you gave me wherever I go, and I think it works pretty well. So, I figured I thought you were supposed to be protecting Adrian from Marinette, the one you said was a bad influence. From now on, you and I are at war. You will lose your friends and wind up all alone, and Adrian will soon be mine. We'll see about that, Lila. We'll see. My plan is taking a little longer than expected, sir. But you won't be disappointed. Will you keep your promise if I succeed? I always honor my commitments. You work too hard, sir. Now's not the time to ease up, Natalie. I'm good friends with the best manga publisher in Japan, you know. I could talk to him about your comic book project if you like. She's such a liar! But you gotta stop obsessing over her, Marinette. I've graded your mock exam papers. Most of you did quite well, some better than others. But before I hand them back, Marinette, could you bring your school bag to me, please? I need to check something. Today, someone placed an anonymous note in my mailbox claiming that you'd stolen the exam answers. And it looks like the anonymous person was right. <sighs> but that's not true! Someone must have planted that piece of paper in my bag! But you answered all of the questions correctly. I did? Yes! But because I studied... Miss Bustier, Marinette always scores high in your tests. This is so terribly unlike you, Marinette. You're usually so well-behaved. Of course. You put the answers in my bag. You're the anonymous informer. I'm coming to your defense and you're accusing me? You can't accuse someone without proof, Marinette. But I'm sure it's her. She stole the test answers. That's impossible, Marinette. Lila got the worst grade in the class. Th then she flunked the exam on purpose. Excuse me, Miss Bustier, but everyone here knows it isn't like Marinette to cheat. Mm-hmm. He's right. It doesn't make sense. You never, never cheat. cheat. You know Marinette. She doesn't need to. Marinette, Lila, please go to the principal's office until we get to the bottom of this. Or I'd make your life unbearable, Marinette. Let's see how you get out of this one. I'm not falling in your trap, Lila. Too late. You already have. Where are you going? You're about to find out. Ready? Ouch! 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 In my office. But, sir, it wasn't me. I didn't do anything. I don't know why Marinette doesn't like me. I've really tried to be her friend, but she keeps calling me a liar, getting the others to gain up against me, and now she's pushing me down the stairs. Oh, those are total lies. Go on, Lila. She even took a necklace I got from my grandmother, a fox pendant. Took as in stole? <laughs> That's not true! I never stole anything! My daughter is not a thief! Why should we believe any of this? You're accusing her without any proof! Oh... Uh, I have proof. Open your locker, please. <gasps> My grandma's pendant! She's making up this whole thing. It wasn't me. I didn't do anything, I swear. <gasps> you know Lila's lying, don't you, Adrian? Mr. Damocles, I don't think... Marinette Dupan Chang, you are expelled from this school. <gasps> 
Lila Rossi was right. This was worth the wait. The downfall of Marinette brings about the despair of everyone who trusted her. I can feel the huge waves of negative emotions as they come crashing down. Are you ready, Natalie? More than ever. Catalyst, I'm giving you back the power to transform me into Scarlet Moth. From now on, you are the almighty Scarlet Moth. Thanks to you, I can now release as many Akumas as I desire. <sighs> Fly away, my little Akumas. Find Marinette and her friends, and evilize them all! Queen, Princess Justice, I am Scarlet Moth. Since the innocent isn't to be believed anymore, I'm giving you both the power to expose the truth. As for you, my desperate loyal ones, disappointed by she who you once admired so much, I'm glad to have you back. In return, you will bring me Ladybug and Cat Noir's miraculous. <laughs> What's wrong? Uh, nothing. Everything's Dark fine. Dark Queen's fault. <laughs> If you had been akumatized, nothing could have stopped you from handing your miraculous over to Hawk Moth. And there would have been no more Ladybug. End of story. We can't let that happen. Neither Lila nor Hawk Moth will win. I'm going to prove my innocence. If only Alia could help me. Alia didn't become akumatized earlier today at school. I'm sure it's because she trusts you. Call her. You're right. So let's recap, right? Your accused is stealing the answers to the mock exam. Evidence one, the paper with the answers was found in your school bag. You're also accused of pushing Lila down the stairs. No one witnessed the actual incident, but everyone did see Lila at the bottom of the staircase. You're also accused of stealing Lila's necklace, which was, evidence two, found inside your locker. And finally, you have a motive. I know for a fact that you've hated Lila since day one because she hangs around Adrian. I'm so glad I called you. Thanks for your support. You're my best friend, Marinette. I totally believe you, but the evidence is stacked against you. The good thing is, the world's greatest reporters always seek the truth, so I'm gonna prove your innocence. Phew. Thanks, all. First off, a culprit always leaves clues. That's a given. And by following these clues, it will lead us to Lila. No, to the guilty party. If you're so quick to accuse Lila, you might just overlook another potential baddie. Oh, <laughs> right. Whoever it was had to have touched your locker when they put the necklace in there. I'm gonna go track down some fingerprints. Marinette, can we have a word? I'll meet you later at your place. Now listen, honey, we love you, but this whole thing has gotten very complicated. And until we've found a new school for you, we've decided that you should help us with the bakery. But I'm telling you, I didn't do anything. If I have to spend all my time in here, how am I gonna be able to prove that I'm innocent? It's fun here in the bakery. You'll see. Once again, Mr. Agrest, make sure she gets lots of rest. Of course. Thank you, Doctor. Perhaps you can still take advantage of the chaos that Lila Rossi has wreaked. That plan is pointless without you. You're right. Uh, then I have to... Uh... There will be no more Catalyst or Mayora. I warned you, using a broken Miraculous ends up breaking its wearer. The wounds on the Miraculous are becoming your wounds. I don't care, Gabriel. I want to help you. Not at that cost. Never at that cost again. Gabriel would never allow me to do this, but I'm going to create a very powerful Sentu monster, the most powerful one that's ever existed. No! Don't do that! You should be resting! Gabriel so desperately wants the Miraculous, and I want to be the one to give it to him. Oh, it's so romantic! 
Dusu. Spread my feathers. Go, my beautiful Amok, and bring my creation to life. I am Myura. You are Cat Noir's true teammate, and you've won gold to get hold of the miraculous. I'm ready, Myura. Always make sure you've got your right angles there. Then you fold the pastry, fold it toward you first, about two thirds of the way. Uh, can I please answer? We're not done with our flaky pastry yet. Okay, so here's the skinny on my investigation so far. No fingerprints, no evidence. Whoever did this was very thorough. I'm sorry, we'll be in touch. <laughs> <laughs> this is Nadia Shimok, live from the Arc de Triomphe, where Ladybug is battling against a new supervillain. I am Mayura, and I'm about to annihilate Ladybug. <laughs> Tell me, we have to go and help your lady. She and I are on the same team, Flag. We'll help Marinette, but first... Flag, pause out! <laughs> Can't go to the rescue, m'lady. Pretend to be hurt. <sighs> Ladybug's fighting a peacock villain at the Arc de Triomphe. Isn't Cat Noir oh. with her? Uh, what's this about Ladybug and Mayura? It must be one of Hawkmoth's traps. I've got to get there before Cat Noir gets tricked. Hmm? <laughs> oh, I'm such a clutch. Can I go change my clothes, Dad? No need, sweetie. Don't worry. A good baker is never afraid to get dirty. You can change after you're done decorating these gingerbread men. You okay? Don't worry about me. Go after my Yura. Ow! Uh, uh, ow! Can't know her. I don't feel so good. There's something wrong. We're supposed to be nearly invulnerable. He doesn't suspect a thing. Grab his miraculous, his ring before the real ladybug gets here. Can't know her. Don't leave me. What? What's going on? I have always gone out of my way to hide my true feelings for you. But I just can't do it anymore. But I thought you said you loved somebody else. It's... it's over. After all this time, I've realized you're always here for me, even when I keep rejecting you. Your feelings for me haven't changed, and mine are growing stronger every day. I can't keep pretending anymore. Now! You're confusing uh, fantasy with reality. You're not Ladybug? No, she's not me. She's manipulating you. You know I'm already in love with someone else. <sighs> listen to your heart. Oh, listen to your brain. You're just an illusion. <laughs> See, I'm real enough. Impossible. There can't be two Ladybugs. She must be a fan of Ladybug who's been akumatized by a hot mob. Don't fall for her tricks! Milady, no! You've got a villain to fight. We'll take care of me later. That's the lady I know. Oh, I can't believe you fell for that! Okay, good job. You win. I am the fake ladybug. But there's no way I'm letting you cataclysm my earrings. What? Why does she... You want to bet? Oh, you, Cat Noir. Cat no, not the earrings. Hello, Mayura. Huh? Mayura? But... She looks so real! Things aren't always what they seem to be at first sight. This ladybug isn't an illusion or an akumatized person. Uh-huh, she's a senti monster. But she's so much more elaborate than any of those we faced before. They're so perfect, there's nothing monstrous about her at all. Sorry, Kitty, but you should have known. 
I'm nowhere near as perfect as her. I love you just the way you are, milady. Got a hint of where the amok is. Look at what my ear is holding. Whatever it takes, steal their miraculous from them and don't hold back. Senti charge! <laughs> Whoa. I'll show you a real lucky charm! Okay, you're definitely the real one. <laughs> Nuru, why didn't you wake me up? I couldn't bring myself to, Master. You were sleeping so peacefully. <laughs> My hero looks exhausted. That's your chance to bring her down and find out who's behind the mask. <gasps> What's going on? You're right. There's nothing monstrous about her. Whoever possesses this controls the Senti Monster. She couldn't help but follow orders. Senti Monster, you're free now. I won't give you orders, but I ask you, help us grab my Yura's Miraculous. Thank you, Ladybug. I will help you. Are we cool or are we cool? We could call ourselves Cat Noir and his Ladybugs. I prefer the Bugettes and Kitty Cat. What do you think? You're in charge, Ladybug. <sighs> I should have guessed. How could you? Getting sentimental on a sentiment monster? Not. You're the real monster! Oh, that. You'll find out very soon. We miss you, Grandpa! You don't mind calling you Grandpa, right? You won't be joking around when I take your miraculous! Ken cover me! Check, Ladybug. No! Shadowclaws! Good move, Kitty. Now all I have to do is grab my Yura's Miraculous and it's over. Checkmate, Hawk Moth. You better surrender. <laughs> all I need to do is wait a few minutes until you and your pet transform back into regular kids. So fragile, so easy to break. Release him! Release her! Don't mind me. Don't listen to him! You had my Yura right where you wanted her. I could have managed by myself. Why'd you do that? Because we're Ladybug and Cat Noir. Ladybug by itself doesn't sound half as cool. You shouldn't say things like that to me. But the real Ladybug's heart still belongs to someone else. <laughs> I should have guessed that too. Miraculous Ladybug! <laughs> I guess even your miraculous ladybugs can't bring our baguette back. Peacock's superpower can be so cruel when wrongly used, even more than the butterfly's one. You've disobeyed me again, Natalie, and you put yourself in danger for nothing. <laughs> your idea was brilliant, but you don't need a miraculous to help me. There was something else you needed my Yura for, to find the Guardian. I'm not so sure anymore. If you ever need my Yura again, I'll be here for you. Thank you. Oh, Adriano! Come stai? I'm good. Thanks, Giuseppe. Uh, Lila? Do you know each other? Uh, oh, my! Your papa's new muse is incredible. She's been all around the world. She knows all the celebrities, and she's Italian, just like me. Hi, Adrian. You're going to give me tons of tips because I'm not as experienced as you are. Would you mind leaving us alone for a second? Sure. I warned you once already, Lila, but you didn't listen. You hurt my friend Marinette, and that's not okay. Me? 
Hurry, Marinette! But she's the I don't know how to prove you lied, Lila, because you're good at it. So you'll have to come up with another lie, just as convincing. Only this time it's gonna prove Marinette's innocent. Why would I do that, Adrian? Because we're friends, aren't we? And because of this rare disease, sometimes I can't control things I say. I'm really sorry, Marinette. Thank you for your confession, Lila. It's very moving. Marinette, you will of course be allowed back in school tomorrow. <laughs> People should know better. Things aren't always what they seem to be at first sight. So, look, I don't know why you felt the urge to start all this, or why all of a sudden you lied to fix this mess, but I'm glad to see you're capable of coming back to your senses. Sometimes. As you said, things aren't always what they seem to be at first sight. <laughs> I knew my daughter was innocent all along. <laughs> oh, aren't those your classmates? <laughs> and this week we'll be visiting the set of Gabriel Agrest's most recent photo shoot for an exclusive interview with his new muse, Miss Lila. Oh, I'm glad her disease doesn't stop her from following her dreams. 